The day after the bombings and the people of Boston were torn between mourning and attempting to get back to normal life. Parts of the marathon route in the city centre were reopened to traffic, although the bomb blast sites remained sealed off. But many locals were still shocked from the tragedy, which has brought back painful memories. It definitely brings me back to 9-11. Um, it made me think about that and how I was really young when that happened, so I didn't understand the severity. And to now be an adult and to have it be my city, it's just, it's heartbreaking. But has the horror of what happened at the marathon finishing line spread fear among athletes? Will it stop them from competing in similar races around the world? I don't believe that we as runners should be intimidated by such incidents. It is, of course, terrible what happened and what unfortunately can always happen again. But I'm confident that we will be able to overcome this tragedy. In a bid to find something positive, marathon organisers have reflected that if Boston's medical teams hadn't been so well prepared for the race, the number of deaths might have been far higher. Our correspondent in Boston says... The day after the deadly bombings, the city of Boston is still trying to come to terms with what happened. For many, the period of quiet after 9-11 is over. And American society is once again asking... Why are we hated so much? Stefan Grober, Euronews, Boston.